And so for the duration of the shoot, I actually, uh, you know, Tommy was a big man. Blessed. And, and yeah. so anyway, I, uh, I wore these uh, bare steel balls. <laughs> I didn't want to. I didn't want to tell you because I. You didn't I'm so know. Glad the I, didn't know. I did. So, yeah. I. You know. So just in case you need a little weight when you walk into a room. Here's my oh, board. Wow. These for me. Oh. Wear them with pride, baby. <laughs> like I need to kind of feel like a man. Wow. <laughs> you are. Well. <laughs> well. Uh, anyway, Lily James and Sebastian Stan are with us, and uh, as are Tommy Lee's uh, brass balls. We'll be right back. <laughs> You, Lily, when I heard you were going to play her, I was like, okay, I can see it. I'm not sure. Then the picture. You and the rest of the world. <laughs> I went bananas. What did it feel like to give her up, to not be Pamela? I think she'd be hard to give up. Yeah, it was kind of a sad day. <laughs> yeah, I am full from grace. <laughs> but there's a scene with your manhood. How did you, how did your scene partner react? How did he do? You'd have to ask uh, the, <laughs> the four men that operated him <laughs> that, that stood loyally behind me <laughs> and looked bravely into the light. <sighs> Once more, dear friends. <laughs> Once more, you know. Um, Sebastian, what was it like for you the first time you saw Lily as Pamela? I, I, listen, I, I it, 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 look, it definitely. <laughs> I mean, it made me blush. What do you want me to say? Like, I can't even, like, we, <laughs> you know, I, 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 I had a, look, all I can say is I had a, I had a front seat to, to this great, ama amazing transformation. And, and it was really um, amazing to go to work with her every day. Oasis? <laughs> Did yeah. They... <laughs> yeah. Um, Spice Roses. Spice Girls, yeah. <laughs> Backstreet. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that was really cool. It was so freezing that day. It was like, and he and Craig was like, you guys are gonna have to go in the water. And we're like, oh my this God. This dread <laughs> rising. So Sebastian gave me one of his ear pods. And so we had like in sync music and we were sort of just dancing to stay warm because it was like freezing. And then we had to run into the sea and it was one take and the yeah. sun was setting. So it's so funny when something looks so like romantic and it's like so picturesque, but really it's yeah. like, go, go, get in the water. Get in the water. Um, and Lily, we all know you're a musical icon now, Mamma Mia 2. Let's talk some of Mamma Mia 3. Thank you very much. It is, well, you, 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 you I smashed I, it. I think I'm spotting it on that, on that bookshelf over there. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. Apparently there's a Mamma Mia 3. Could Donna be back? Second question, Sebastian, we've seen you singing in a very good collard video. <laughs> Hello, is it me you're looking for? Are you going to be in it, musical oh. together? I, I just learned that I am replacing Don yeah. uh, Cooper, actually. <laughs> I, I haven't spoken to him in a while. See how he's hanging on, but uh, yeah, I, I didn't speak in my own accent for like four months, and so when I started speaking like me, it was really shocking. I was like, oh, well, I didn't, I forgot what I kind of, uh, I suddenly sounded really proper in English. It was bizarre. Now, uh, Lily, I mentioned this, but I have to ask you, I know this is kind of uh, above your control, but what do we need to do to make Mamma Mia 3 happen? Like, what What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> I'm desperate for it to happen. It was, it was like non, it didn't feel real. It was so fun just singing on a beach <laughs> and on a boat. I don't know, why isn't it happening? We all need it, it's been COVID, it's been terrible. Let's do Mamma Mia. <laughs> we need it, please, please, yeah. please, please. <laughs> only if I'm in it, they probably won't have me. It'll probably be like the Sophie's baby. Anyway, let's stop talking about <laughs> No, I you won't. have to be in it, you're a gem. Yeah, you should come and be in it. <laughs> Sebastian, are you a mom? No, wait. <laughs> I just remember this. I talked to Sebastian a couple, like two years ago, and you said you had never seen Mamma Mia. Has that changed? Uh, it, ha it has changed because- <laughs> Thank you. You thought you were putting up the serious pressure. Lily doesn't know that I went through her entire filmography <laughs> oh at, at the end of 2020, trying oh, yeah. to be like, okay, who am I gonna? And we actually came close to this one movie too. And But anyway, yeah, I've seen it. Did, did you like having all of that, those tattoos? Did it make you want to get one? 
Um, I always thought about tattoos, but I never, I never went there. So, but if I will get a tattoo, I think it's gonna have to be Mamma Mia three. Yeah. <laughs> All across my chest. <laughs> Great idea. Because now I want that movie to happen. <laughs> but, um, you know, the, the biggest key to it really was I worked with this amazing trainer. He's called Matt Bevan and he's just the best. And I got so fit physically and you you did the same. I mean, you had such a huge I transformation in your body. Eat, yeah, but... <laughs> and ran on an empty stomach. Yeah. But that yeah. really helped because Pam was so athletic. So to get to feel so strong and like um, that, that was that was a great confidence booster. What was your first impression of one another? Because you'd never worked together before, right? No. No. Um... Lily, first impressions of. <laughs> well, I was so excited to work with him, and I I know his work, and I and I uh, I felt like I felt you always feel sort of nervously excited to get to work with someone new and see what the energy is going to be like in the connection, the way you work. And I would say with Sebastian, he's so challenge it she challenges you in the best possible way you could dream of as an actor because he's so instinctive and impulsive and I really feel like you really do feel like you made me a lot better and you're always like pushing for the unexpected and the brave choices and <laughs> it's just really and so for this when we were already stretching ourselves so hugely playing different people it felt nice to for it to feel really alive and yeah you know it was and yeah it was great y'all are cute blows blushing when you talk like, like this <laughs> well it's oh. weird it's complimenting someone when you're right next to them is a strange <laughs> thing it's a good exercise it's lily did you keep the red bathing suit because the run was spot on please say yes no i i asked to and they said no i should have just snuck it in my handbag but no don't have it although i would never wear it let's be honest uh, yes you <laughs> i don't know, can you imagine it was... it's in malibu <laughs> over the weekend never <laughs> say never i'm getting it for you oh, glory day. <laughs> yeah i mean interview? <laughs> so so say, no but you do he and he inhabits every like every fiber of him it's so like in the moment it's like so real so to see him have that quality as an actor and then like be completely be tommy is every like the energies of the theater it was just really um <laughs> it made me way better just because i could you know be with sebastian being with tommy <laughs>